We're here in beautiful Cooperstown, New York, the home of the National Baseball Hall of Fame. And today we got a chance to talk to some baseball fans here in Cooperstown and hear what they had to say for the Hall of Fame weekend. We come every year. Uh, this is 25 straight for me and my best friend from high school. Um, so it, it's an annual trek and always uh, you know, a great time to come home is how we kind of feel about it. What player from this class do you like the most? Ooh, um, I would say probably the way Biggio played was incredible. Uh, a, a lot of the things that I did as a middle infielder playing in high school and college. Um, but we did have a chance to see Pedro pitch on multiple occasions. One time coming back from here, we stopped in Baltimore just to watch one of his outings. And uh, he was so dominant, exciting to be able to see him, although it was against our birds. So we didn't like that part of it. Do you like coming to Cooperstown every year? Yes. It's so fun. I like hitting the batting cage, pitching. The most part I like about it is seeing our friend Tyler. You go here every year. Is something that you book your hotel. I'm sure you book it in, in July the year before, right? Well, actually, I have a, a friend that's a retired uh, teacher from the county of New Jersey that lives up here. So I have a, a every year invite to stay with him. Uh, so, but I come to Cooperstown rather regularly. It's it's a great town. Um, this is you meet so many nice people here who have traveled in. There's so many people from Houston here uh, that that's very impressive. The Biggio talking to people who have driven in from Houston, flown in from from the, the rep to uh, see uh, Biggio. That's pretty remarkable. All right, what's some Craig Biggio fans clearly wearing orange and a blue for the Astros? Tell me your name. Where are you from? Anna Reyes from Houston, Texas, obviously. Carol Sanchez, Houston, Texas. Paula Salinas from Houston, Texas. All from Texas. So, all right, you're here for Craig Biggio. Why Why is Craig Biggio your favorite player, or is he? All your favorite players? All, all of our favorite players, absolutely. So, you grew up watching him play 20 years for the Astros. What about him, what about his style do you like? His dedication to the game, never uh, going out there and giving less than 110%. He gives 110% all the time. Right. Yeah. Are you here in Cooperstown for the first time? Yes. yes. First time. First time. First time. And will you return again if Jeff Bagwell gets inducted? Absolutely. Where are you in the talks of that? <laughs> it's, it's in the book. Him and Berkman. That's my favorite player is Bert, Lance Berkman. Yeah, but him and Berkman. Lance Berkman's your favorite. All right, so your first time at Cooperstown, what have you done so far? We've gone to the museum a couple of times. We've been walking around, seeing all the local sites, shopping, of course. <laughs> you're wearing, wearing a Philly shirt, but you're from Massachusetts. You're wearing a lacrosse shirt. You're probably in the wrong town. Why are you guys here? You're here for Red Sox? Pedro's induction, yeah. For Pedro? And Pedro played for the Phillies, so I get a little bit of credit there. <laughs> you get an ounce of credit. A little bit, just a touch. Not much, but... <laughs> You do. Now, talk about Pedro. What, how much did you like Pedro when he played? And you're probably, you probably saw the latter part of his career when he played for the Mets, right? Um, pro yeah. Um, I was also born the year that Pedro won the World Series with the Red Sox. So, there you go. It's the good. year they broke the curse. That's a good year. So, you got some luck on your side. Now, what about Pedro? Did you admire as a baseball fan yourself? Hardest pitcher for his size I've ever seen. I mean, the guy could mow him down. He wasn't a big guy, and he was durable. He was just unbelievable pitcher. Uh, amazing to watch. Love to watch him pitch. Even though I'm not a Red Sox uh, guy at heart, he was fantastic to watch at Fenway the uh, one time I got to see him there. I've been a Red Sox fan since day one, since Ted Williams, bro. Now, a Red Sox fan in New Jersey, though, you probably get killed from a lot of Yankee uh, fans, right? You're absolutely correct with that. You're absolutely correct. But it's a conversational piece when I wear my Red Sox material, you know? So There you go. So what did you like most about Pedro Martinez? He was a winner. He was a winner. He, he, he uh, pitched great in the clutch games. And, uh, hey, all I can say is he was a winner. And the Red Sox won with him the World Series. So, so you guys are excited to see Pedro? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Yeah? What What did you like about Pedro? Well, I like his attitude, and he's just awesome at baseball. <laughs> yeah, he's really good. What he said. All right, so two Pedro fans here. They like his attitude. I don't know if Mom will be too happy about that, but thank you so much. I appreciate it. What position do you like the best? Pitcher. You like pitcher the best? Okay, so you're a pitcher, so I guess do you like to take after Pedro or Randy Johnson? What would you say you're more like? Pedro. Pedro? I guess you're a righty. Yeah.
<laughs> All right. Now, who's your? I didn't ask you. I don't believe. What's your? Uh, who's your favorite player out of this 2015 class? Biggio, because I played for the Astro. Say it again. I played for the Astros. So. You played for the. You played for the Astros. That's the name of your team. Yes. From Cooperstown, New York, at the National Baseball Hall of Fame and Museum, I'm Neil A. Caruso.